There we go, man. I grew up in a rural setting and I saw the pain the farmers went through by purchasing very expensive uh, inputs uh, including fertilizers that instead of it increasing the yields the yields were decreasing year after year this I feel is unacceptable and should not be allowed to happen so I teamed up with a team of people who believed in the dream of changing rural lives and together we have been in a position to develop products that the farmers can use to improve their soil fertility and therefore increase their yields significantly. And in Safi Organics, we believe in providing high quality organic fertilizers for the farmers. What we do, we have come up with a, uh, a new model whereby we get, we buy the farmers waste, use technology to convert this waste to a carbon negative biochar, and then we add a special formula to it, making it a complete fertilizer. This process takes a total of uh, less than six hours to complete the production process. We have used it in a wide range of crops including maize we have used it in rice which is the major crop where uh, we are right now uh, we have used it in tomatoes vegetables and flowers we have a flower uh, product specifically for the flowers and uh, we have used it also in bananas and in coffee and in all these crops we have seen significant improvement in the yields. The years I've been using Safi organic fertilizer. I've seen it very productive since before I was using other fertilizers which we which could not produce like this one. Mm, for example I used to have I used to have 25 bags per acre but now I'm having I'm having like 29 to 30 bags per acre uh, ever since I used ever since I used Safi Organic well the, the, the effects have been very productive when I see such changes uh, in our customers I'm so excited I'm so happy because that's what I'm actually looking at changing the economic status of the small-scale farmers to making them better to have to making them have a better tomorrow some of the lessons that I have derived from my entrepreneurship journey is that failure is inevitable and failure has its advantages and if you don't fail you will not grow so it's through the failure that we really grow alone you cannot really make it but if you want to grow your impact you have to involve others and these other people who becomes either your co-founders or your employees, you have to treat them with respect and then give their best. <laughs>